This is wonderful. Isn't it? Do, do, uh... <laughs> <laughs> So, Les, I'm loving your footwear. You're, you're... Yeah, you know... I'm glad you noticed those, Titchy, because these... Yeah. ...are a type of shoe that I pioneered way back in the early 1970s. Yeah. I go back a long way. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> I'm about the only bloke who wears them. They're comfortable. They give me a bit of presence. Yes. And uh, Engelbert Humperdinck, a singer of yesteryear, still wears this type of footwear. Does he really? <laughs> it's recommended by Engelbert. Engelbert Humperdinck. Now, your studio audience here, and probably a lot of people at home, good day, how are you all? Good afternoon. <laughs> Uh, a lot of people wouldn't remember Engelbert Humperdinck, but he is alive and still managing to sing. Isn't is that he, lovely? Is he, but, <laughs> but what's really sad is this is a retirement performance. Huh? You're going to the Palladium, you're Look, going... You know, I we... can't believe it. In a week's time, Titch, yeah. I... <laughs> in a week's time, I'm going to be on the stage of the Cathedral of British Variety, yeah. the London Palladium. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to be introducing a show. I'm doing a cooking demonstration. Are you really a good cook? I'm a very good cook. Like you're a gardener, Titch. Yeah, yeah. I can <laughs> cook. Yeah. Boy. <laughs> Boy. Favourite dishes? I mean, things you like to cook? I mean. Oh, well, I, I, I like mostly the garnishing. Yes. Uh, the garnishing. I like. Uh, a you mulch, do quite a lot I of garnishing. Like drizzle. <laughs> If I cook something, yeah. I drizzle my emotion, emotion. <laughs> I drizzle my emotion over it. <laughs> and I do coolies. Yeah. Coolies. <laughs> Not being racist here. No, no, I no. Mean, <laughs> that's fruit. Are you, good, are you good with the juice? Juice. Oh, juice. wasabi Jew. Yeah. Wait till you taste that, pal. Oh, yeah. I, look, I've been talking to Alison, your wife. Yes. Oh, she's a beautiful woman, a lonely woman. <laughs> <laughs> well, so she told me, Titchy. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, really? I like yes. popping around there when you're doing a show as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. And, uh, I that explains why when I go home she's always mopping the kitchen floor. <laughs> well, you, you're with Dame Edna. I fed I did... you that line. <laughs> <laughs> you did well. It's very good of you. But you're with Dame Edna. What is this relationship like? Is it tense, the relationship between yeah, you and Dame Edna? It's pretty tense. Yeah. Why? She and me, we'd... look, I've got... Do you know what a demographic is? Well, I wish to you know what a demographic yeah. is. I think so. I don't know much. <laughs> well, I've got enough idea that it's the audience that you appeal to. Yeah. Now, you appeal, don't you, to nice people. I hope so. Very <laughs> nice people. Yeah. And so do I. Yeah. I appeal particularly to elderly women. Do you? <laughs> well, there's a sprinkling of them here. <laughs> Looking at one Sheila, a lovely old bird down there. <laughs> She's giving me a bit of the old Sharon Stone, as a matter of fact. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say that on your program? You just have. <laughs> and uh, I also appeal. Would you like a smoke, by the way? No, no, I'm, I don't. No, no, no. no you no. don't? No, I don't. No. Oh. Perhaps it's not allowed. Oh, they're no, giving me signals. We're not allowed in here. Oh, isn't that a pity? In the yeah. old days, you remember the old days of London Weekend? This is London Weekend, isn't it? Yes, yes. The indeed. old days. The old one, yeah. I seen blokes doing the weather report and smoking. <laughs> it wasn't that long ago, was it, ladies and gentlemen? No. No, no, it's a shame. But now, it's all over. But is it all over for you? Are we, is this really goodbye, Celeste Patterson? No, listen, I. My government in Australia insists that I cling on like a limpet. <laughs> I am needed to project Australia's image. A lot of people get the wrong idea of Australia. It's not all Shane Warne and Liz Hurley. It's not all that glamour. It's, it's, it's masculinity. I mean, I am a very masculine person. A lot of people think of me, uh, they mistake me in the street for sort of Butch Alan Carr, as a matter of fact. <laughs> <laughs> But, but 
We've had a new Prime Minister. Yeah. Our new yes. Prime Minister, Tony Abbott, yes. born in London. Yes, of course. So he's a Palmy. Educated here, yeah. The previous Prime Minister, a total disaster, I'm afraid, Julia Gillard, Welsh. Yes. <laughs> Giving you everything, really, I mean, right? why are they passing me by? Well, I had a friend... <laughs> I had a friend who went to Australia and he said, do you have a criminal record? And he said, I didn't know it was still necessary. <laughs> <laughs> can I ask you? We can take it, Joe. <laughs> so, Les, what I've never known is for what you were given your knighthood. What did you get your knighthood for? Services to the entertainment industry. Really? Yeah. I've been around a long time, Titchy. Yeah. yeah. And I... <laughs> I've been a lot of these Dame Edna shows. Yeah. But it's me they come to see. A lot of people say, oh, Les gets a bit raunchy. Uh -huh. This lady down here can't get enough of it, can you, darling? <laughs> is it true that you still give them Macintoshes in the front row, or is that Well, listen, that? I do have... Yeah. You know, I've got a little bit of an expectoration problem. <laughs> but uh, there are... You know, I... You won't believe this, Titch. Yeah. But I... <laughs> Not long ago, I was on a stage, blow me in the middle of the front row is a beautiful looking woman. Yeah. Oh, magnificent looking. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and, <laughs> Sit up, yeah. And she's like sitting there, more or less in the same physical attitude as that old Sheila. <laughs> and she's staying, spit on me, Les, spit on me. <laughs> It's disgusting, isn't it? <laughs> and yet, it's harmless. Listen, I mean no harm. You know that. The women here, there's a woman who's been looking at the floor for a very long time. <laughs> it must have been somewhere you passed earlier. <laughs> you can touch the Les and Dame Edna. No, it's listen, nemesis. I'm a family entertainer. Yes, you are. And I'm cooking. I'm going to give you some cooking tips from the stage of the Palladium. Yep. And after that, it's Edna can take over okay. because it's a beautiful show. You led her on. We look forward to you. You can catch him and Dame Edna at the London Palladium from the 13th November. My thanks. I have a feeling Thank we'll Thank you very see much him. for that plug, mate. We'll see. It's a pleasure. <laughs> it's a pleasure, cobbler. We'll see you later. My thanks to Sir Les Patterson. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.